that's my prayer. <laughs> they besought him to touch him. When God touches you, oh Jesus, <laughs> everything about you change when he touches you. The situation, whether good or bad, doesn't look the same anymore. See, it's, it's something about that touch that no matter what you're going through, your mind will go back to that touch. See, because you, you'll never forget it. You can go get stone drunk, and he'll talk to you while you're stone drunk. And ask you what you're doing here, and why are you here? Why are you here in the cave, Elijah? You, you just kissing that person. Y'all finna... What you doing here? Get up. Get your clothes on. Lean. Wait, wait, wait. Well, we, it's, you be trying to talk to the Lord. When it's too late, we, we going in. No, it ain't never too late. Get up. And get your clothes on. Amen. But we don't we, we don't believe that. We be in the bed every time I get behind me, Satan. <laughs> Knowing the Lord talking to you. Amen. You rebuking the Holy Spirit, wondering why he ain't talking to you for two or three weeks. All right, I'm just saying. Maybe it's just me. <laughs> Maybe I'm the only one he ain't speaking to. I'm sorry. He touches you to keep your mind. He touches you to keep your spirit. He, he touches you to keep your body. And then he brings all those scriptures back to your remembrance. You know your body is the temple of the Lord. Don't do it. You know, be ye holy, for I am holy. You're like, really? He just be wearing on you. Holy Spirit wear you out. You can't even go to sleep. He'll, he'll meet you there. <laughs> I said, well, let me go to sleep real early because I know he finna fuss at me. I know we're going to have a long discussion. Now I'm, I'm going to go ahead and go to sleep real quick. Go to sleep. He met me there in a dream. Told me, well, if you go this way, this is what's going to happen. And if you go that way, that's what's going to happen. He'll meet you in your dream. And then you wake up and you can't forget that dream. You can't shake it. It's, it's so vivid and live color, you be sitting there at the breakfast table talking, oh, God. trying to forget it. It's because he touched you. He touched your mind. You can't turn it off. Verse 23. And he took the blind man by the hand and led him out of town. And when he had spit on his eyes and put his hands upon him, he asked him if he saw out. Hmm. See, sometimes Jesus got to take you somewhere. See, he took the man. See, he, he, see, he, he has to take you to your... <laughs>